Hi, I'm Matteo, the Chief Mobile Opinionist here at Tech Travel Geeks. And here at Tech Travel Geeks, obviously we cover consumer electronics, gadgets, accessories, things we think make the travel experience better. And we do also occasionally cover things such as clothing, which we think are very useful in travel. Especially if you travel with me, you'll likely end up doing a lot of walking. Previously, we've covered Giesvin Merino wool trainers here on the Tech Travel Geeks YouTube channel. And this time, we're going to cover a pair of trainers I purchased, which are by a company called Allbirds, already quite popular on the internet. So, this is a company called Allbirds, who are relatively new, so they're less than, less than a 10-year-old company. And they pride themselves in making sustainable footwear and clothing. And Allbirds, in the case of this pair of shoes, say that they are carbon neutral. That's because the materials that make these shoes, the processes they use and their distribution and offsetting, all contribute to a sustainable pair of trainers. So let's have a look at the box. This is how it arrived from their website after I ordered them. So the shipping label is on the box itself, which means that there's no extra packaging, no extra plastic bags or anything. And when you open up the box, you have a simple box, no unnecessary paper or things in the box, no actual documentation about the shoes, apart from a little point about the fact that the shoes are sustainable and a QR code to the website to where you can see them. So the idea is that with this box, you can also use it if you, you're selling them in store to display the shoes. But in this case, this is how they were delivered. And I'm really quite impressed with this. Now, this is the Allbirds Tree Runners. This is a running shoe, admittedly, but which is very, very popular just for day-to-day -day use. Let's take them out of the box. Now, as I said, there's no extra plastic bags, no extra documentation or labels. And on the inside of the shoe to keep shape, there's a little cardboard insert. There you go. That's all there is. And the point of these Allbirds tree runners is that they're made out of sustainable materials. And in this case, the upper part, the mesh part of the shoes is made out of eucalyptus fiber. It's a fiber derived from eucalyptus. And this midsole, the sole, which is the actual sole with tread and the midsole, is made out of sugarcane, processed sugarcane. And the insole itself, let's see if we can get that out. The Allbirds insole is made out of castor oil and merino wool in this case. So it's all made out of sustainable materials. Even before the offsetting of the shoes, all birds claim that the carbon footprint of these shoes, which is not a pun, the carbon footprint of this, these shoes is around about five kilograms of carbon emissions. Now, as someone who has had their fair share of carbon emissions, I'm glad that I've purchased one thing which will be reducing my overall carbon emissions, but I'm afraid I'm horribly in the negative. So. Let's put the insole back in the shoe. Oh, hello. I've got Kitten Taylor here, who's decided to be part of the process and go after those, those purple shoelaces. Oh, I forgot to mention, those shoelaces are also made out of recycled material. In this case, they're made out of recycled plastic bottles. Okay, so shoelaces are undone. I've widened them a bit because I have some relatively wide feet. And I'll do the same with the other shoe. And there we go. So first impression is quite positive. They're well-built shoes. And the insole, you might not even need to use the, the shoelaces because the tongue is kept in by an elastic material on the inside, which is quite interesting. But for the sake of the video, let's put these on. 
Now they are quite a smug fit, as you'd expect from a pair of mesh trainers. I'm going to pull the tongue out. And there we go. We have a decent fit. In this case, I was reading up on the internet, seeing other people's reviews. The Allbirds Tree Runners are recommended to be snug when you get them because the eucalyptus fiber of the mesh will naturally soften over time. Now, the other good thing about Allbirds, just as with Gisvin and other brands of shoes, is it's very easy to just put these in the wash. You take the insole and the, and the, and the strings out and put them through the wash. There we go. Easy peasy. Yeah, so overall I'd say these have a good feel in terms of the roll and the overall feel of these tree runners. Nice shoes. So this is obviously an unboxing and first impressions. They feel really snug, but breathable. The color obviously is something that I chose this way and obviously I think this is something that we'll need to do a long-term review of in a few weeks time before we can pass final judgment but first impressions are very very positive they fit well they're snug and elastic and they, you can feel there's some ventilation in there I'm quite liking these shoes as they start off Anyway, um, if you haven't already, check out our Gisvin Merino Wool Runner video, which we covered here on the Tech Travel Geeks YouTube channel last year, and see what you think of those trainers. Let us know in the comments if you'd like to know more about the Old Birds Tree Runners, or you'd like to see a side-by-side -side comparison between these Old Birds and maybe the equivalent Gisvin trainers. That may be something that we can do if there's enough interest. But for now, thanks for watching if you made it this far into our, whoops. If you made it this far into our unboxing and first impressions of the Allbirds Tree Runners. If you don't already, please do subscribe to the Tech Travel Geeks here on YouTube. We cover consumer electronics, gadgets, accessories, clothing, and anything else we think makes the travel experience better. But for now, Thanks for watching and goodbye from us. There we go. You part of the process, little one. Oh, oh man, getting this insole in is a bit of a challenge. One for the blooper. Any day. Any day. Oh, little Kayla. Oh.